Mr. Attorney General, we don't have the report in hand, so could you explain for us the special counsel's articulated reason for not reaching a decision on obstruction of justice and if it had anything to do with the department's longstanding guidance on not indicting a sitting president and you say you disagreed with some of his legal theories. What did you disagree with him on? Um, the, I, I, I'd leave it to his description in the report, the special counsel's own articulation of, of why he did not want to make a determination as to whether or not there was an obstruction of fence. But I will say that when we met with him, uh, Deputy Attorney General uh, Rosenstein and I met with him along with Ed O'Callaghan, uh, who is the principal associate deputy. On March 5th, we specifically asked him about the OLC opinion and whether or not he was taking the position that he would have found a crime but for the existence of the OLC opinion. And he made it very clear several times that that was not his position. He, he was not saying that but for the OLC opinion he would have found a crime. He made it clear that he had not made the determination that there was a crime. Yeah. Do you disagree 